Okay, I started the recording, the microphone's on, and I'm ready to uh, start the recording. So, first thing I want to do is go over here to terminal, click terminal, new terminal, so that it shows at the bottom. And I'm going to do clear. And there's nothing in this folder right now. So you can move stuff into it later or you can have it already loaded. What you, the project you want to create, that's fine. Uh, it's Im probably important that it's brand new. There's no Git because the, you're not even going to get on Git at all and during any of this. So don't even worry about Git. Git, you need Git set up, but you don't have to actually go to get to set anything up so you're setting everything up from here in Heroku so first thing I'm going to do is type in Heroku create hit enter here and it's going to create a application on Heroku from here so I don't have to create it on Heroku. I create it from here. Okay, it created a Whispering Shore 28406 Heroku.com. And, and it created a, a Git repository with the same name. So if you see that information stored right there and you can actually click on it here. So I'm going to stop the video. I'll, I'll, I'm going to try to put two videos together uh, and see if that works, but I'm going to stop it right here. Okay, I'm recording again. Microphone's on, so I'm going to start here. So I'm logging in to Heroku. It should give me a list of my projects. And let's see, this one was Whispering Shore 28406. So if I go over here, Whispering Shore 28406, this one right here. So this is the new one. So I'm going to click on that, and it's going to open it up. Now, uh, I need resources, so I'm going to open here, and then there's this find more add-in, so I'm going to click on that. Then I'm going to there was a search. I don't see the search button on here. Uh, I'm looking for that shark. Yeah, here it is. My shark DB MySQL. I want to click on that. And that brings me up to this page. And I'm going to hit the install Charles DB MySQL. Click that. And then there you need your um, Whispering Shore account again. So I'm gonna, if you don't know it, it's gonna it's gonna make it a lot harder. Yeah, there Whispering Shore, that one right there. That's the one I want. And submit order form. Okay, it's attached, and then you're going to get some information from here. 
So you're going to click down here. I think the oh, oh, click right here. It's going to load up a page. You're going to need this page. Um, there's really one piece of information on this page that you need and that's this right here so copy that the rest of that information is on the page but you can get it off just that connection string so I'm going to copy the connection string over to your page And of course, you can copy the host name, the user name, the password, and the database name off too. But but they're all embedded because that's the username, that's the password, up to the semicolon. And then there's an at sign. From the at sign down to the semicolon is the host name, and then the database name is over there at the end. So that's the part that you need to set up the connection. So I'll stop right here.